Yo, what is going on guys? It's Cameron here. Welcome back to a brand new video. And in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to get gold weapons every single time you get abducted by the UFO. So guys, it's going to be another tips and tricks guide video. It's been a really long time since I've just done a gameplay tips and tricks video for you guys. So yeah, who doesn't want legendary guns right at the spawn, right when you start the game? Uh, for those of you that don't know, there's these UFOs, there's three of them in every single game uh, hovering over the map. You can see them in your map uh, when you first land, just land at one of them, fly over to one. Because uh, I'm going to give you some good pointers on how I get basically every single game legendary gold loot. So uh, yeah, strap in guys. And it also works if you're playing solos, duos, squads, although it's always better to have a friend with you, right? So uh, yeah, guys, before we jump into that, though, if you are new to my channel, my name's Cameron. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and like the video. I'm bringing you guys good Fortnite know-how and just good tips and tricks. So yeah, guys, if that's your thing, make sure to hit that subscribe button, join the family, and let's get into it. Also, guys, this video is sponsored by NoPing. It's this little guy right here. I have the app already downloaded. If you guys want to check out NoPing, there's going to be a link to it in the description. What it does is it reduces your ping and therefore gives you a better connection to Fortnite. Basically, it makes it so you don't lag as much while you're playing the game in Fortnite. Uh, you actually get an awesome free subscription for, I think, like a week um, at the link in my description as well. So make sure to click that. You can sign up. And yeah, it's it's done wonders for me. I was able to reduce my ping by about half when I'm running this app. Also, guys, there's this really cool perk with it, which I'm going to show you right now. So, of course, you got Fortnite right here, which you can pick a server that will reduce your ping. But uh, you can actually go up here to this little gear right here. And there's an option here to uh, boost FPS. So, yeah, you can get faster frames per second while you're playing Fortnite or hundreds of other games. Uh, so yeah, it's pretty cool. I just wanted to give you guys that little tip and no ping, but let's get back to the video here. All right, guys, so in the gameplay that you're going to be witnessing here, I do get gold loot, and I think we do it in like a minute or two, so it's pretty quick. Um, first mention I just want to give you guys is you'll get like this, uh, let's just call it like a photon ray blaster. Um, <laughs> I don't know what you call the weapon that you get in the abduction area, but they give you this weapon. It has infinite ammo. Uh, basically, I just wait till the split second I see an enemy land on the ground and you don't have to hit them directly just within a few feet of the target and it'll make them like fly back and often you can shoot them off the, the edge of the cliff and they fall down and waste like 10 seconds. So yeah guys, I, I would just um, like plan it out so you shoot your little ray gun right when they hit the ground because it has like a splash zone radius that'll uh that'll help you out a lot especially on coins if you see one of them or like getting one of those uh stars because you need five of them right um in order to advance and get the legendary loop wait for them to just about land on the star and and trying to pick it up and then you shoot them off and then you land on it and pick it up uh, another really good tip, and you might see it a few times in this video, whenever I'm about to get a star so I can get my next upgrade up to like green, blue, purple, and then, then lastly, um, orange, legendary. What I do before I pick up the star is I will jump sometimes a second time and that throws people off. They'll shoot because they think I, I'm landing and picking it up, but I fake them out and then when I land again the second time, they have to reload or, or wait for the cooldown and I'm able to pick it up. So yeah, that's another really great tip for you guys. Uh, some other tips, guys, I want to give you in these UFO abduction things to get legendary loot every time. Um, you'll notice there's a lot of, uh, of people jumping around and stuff. There's going to be two or three of them dropping sometimes. If you see everybody go to one of them, just let them go and then go to the one that's uncontested. Because like 9 out of 10, you're going to get the one that's not contested when there's multiple. Also, guys, if you're playing like duos, trios, or squads, make sure that you have somebody who's just designated to just get time. For those of you who don't know, you are timed in these. Uh, it's a, a 60 second countdown from the beginning, and there's these five second add on uh, little clock uh, things you have to pick up to, you know, add more time uh, so you can get more stars in time before the timer runs out. So I would designate like one or two people, depending on how big your squad is uh, to just solely pick up the time and to use that as like their main mission and have the other people just the, um, you know, the, 
the star runners, um, you could call them. The people who just go for the star upgrades so you can get to uh, as many stars as possible without running out of time. And like I said, I'm having really good success with this with my team. We have uh, like uh, my wife, for instance, plays with me and she gets all the time. I just basically just wait back and try to get the stars once they land. And yeah, I mean, we get gold like every single time. Uh, but yeah, guys, it's really fun to get the legendary loot right at the start of the match. Um, I hope these tips help. There's one other tip I want to give you. Once you get your legendary loot and you're leaving the vault area and it sends you off the UFO, you will have, you'll be at like max height deploying down. So what we do is we land on one of the three slurp trucks, or actually there's four of them. One of the slurp trucks, you know, around the map, we just land on them so we can get full shield and we're back in the match immediately. So that way we're, we're full shield, we're ready to go, plus we have all of our legendary guns. It could not be any better start to a match other than that. So yeah, that's just what we do every single time, guys, and it's been proving to be pretty well, um, uh, to be good for us. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Do you guys do these same tactics? Is there other tactics you guys have? But as always, it's your boy Cameron. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out for now.